Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. So today we're playing another part of Generations. I know it's been a while since I've really been... I'm trying to record, okay? I'm trying. I can't get in the mood to play The Sims, honestly. It's really, really hard for me. Like, I kind of... I just want to relax on the weekends. It's like my only days off and so I just want to chill and maybe play some games on my own. So I'm trying to get back into the recording aspect of my life. Um, I did try this earlier and I've been trying to get this part ready because this part's a big part for me. So it takes a lot of time but I came down with like a big ass migraine and I had to go lay down for like two hours which really just was a waste of my time. But you know had to do it. Anyway, so things might look a little bit different. Um, quite a few things have happened in the midst of making this part. Um, we'll get into it. Alright, so I'm going to zoom out. Alright, <laughs> so welcome back to Generations. We are in a completely brand new house, you guys. Um, so, I literally gave you guys a sneak peek of this house um, in the last part. It was a very small glimpse of it. Um, but this house was actually in my original generation's house. This house was built by a friend of mine that is here on YouTube. I'll find her channel and link it down below. I think she made a new channel, um, so I'll link it. But, if I don't, remind me because I got to give her credit for this house. Um, but she did a beautiful job. I love this house. I kept this house for a reason because I wanted to come back to it eventually. Um, and luckily, it was big enough to where I could fit all of these sims in it. Um, so we're going to start. We luckily have a beautiful school bus in my way. Um, we love to see it. Love um, that the kids still go to school. I did make a lot of changes in this house. This house was... I think I, in the first time I did this house, it was like a bright orange. Uh, sadly, I am no longer into the bright colors of when it comes to decorating. I love darker colors now. Um, you know, we are growing up, we're maturing. We don't, you know, we like darker colors now. Uh, <laughs> it's a weird fact. Um, so over here, uh, we have, can I stop saying um? It's really bugging me. We have our little, I'm in the bus. Oh my god, I've never seen the bus before. This was how I used to see things when I was younger on the school bus. Anyway, back to the game. I'm losing my mind. So we have our cat um, bungalow over here. And just for the cat to kind of play and do its thing, um, we're going to jump into the house now. I need to do some decorating to the front yard, but honestly, I gave up. Okay, I've been spending days on this house. And I keep giving up because it's just a really big house. Um, so yeah, I still need to do the hallway because it looks very boring, very plain. Um, we'll go this way. <laughs> we'll go into the first door over here. We have our laundry room. It is uh, just red, black, and white themed. It's really cute, really small, really like it. And then we just have a garage. Nothing big. Um, I did put in this little worker station because I really wanted Aiden to get into like... Um, this stuff and then I just have um, all the fire stuff like the fireman stuff like the jacket and the hatchet I think that's a hatchet or an axe whatever that is and then the fire alarm and then just some toys um, sadly we won't really be needing those anymore um, oh and then you know it leads out to a driveway anyway we'll go this way um, Oliver is standing there looking all gracious we'll go this way to the kitchen um, I love my kitchen love my kitchen so like this house is really based off like elders um when it comes to decorating i just love it so we just have like woods and whites and it's really really pretty um we have our little trash can and our refrigerator and stuff like that and then i put in a wood fire oven so we can make pizzas and lasagnas and stuff um but i really really like it and then we just have like the fit the pet the pet the pet food bowl with like a little apron and then like our little dining table area that looks out into the front yard and then just like um grandma can and stuff i don't know she just puts a lot of stuff in jars and we just keep it anyway 
<sighs> okay, let's keep going. Um, we'll go this way into our living room. We have a lot of browns in this house. Uh, so yeah, we just have like a little seating area. Someone forgot their coffee, as always, dirty ass kids. We finally have our little rocking chair, so Will can you know relax and do his damn thing while he watch TV. Um, we just um, I'm going to assume this is our family. Don't know. Back in the twenties, I don't know. And then like our little TV area. Um, I love this. I just put like a lot of crap into like wicker baskets and stuff. So we have like pillows and picture frames and all that kind of stuff. And I really, really like it. I think it's really cute. Um, so we'll go here because this is Will and Nicole's room. Nicole? Is her name Nicole? I don't even know my son's names. Honestly, it's the parents' room. <laughs> um, as you can see, let me get this right. This is Nicole, right? Okay. I feel like retarded. Anyway, probably going to get a sneak peek into other room. Oh, no, we're not. Okay. This is Nicole and Will's room. Obviously, Nicole kind of took over. It's very pink and green and blue, and it just reminds me of my grandma. And I honestly adore it. I think it's the cutest little bedroom. Honestly, it's based off these pictures right here because I think they're just so cute. It's just, ugh, it's so cute. It's so cute. And then we just have, like, pictures that Will forgot to hang for Nicole because, you know, he's an elder and he forgets to do things. And then they just have their own little private bathroom, um, just, like, woods and blues and simple they don't they can't stand long they need to sit so they have a tub no shower just a tub um but then we can go back out this door and it leads us right back into the living room and then we will we'll go across we'll go across i'm going to tell you guys right now this room is uh, empty um this is clementine's room uh yeah there's no lights in here, sorry. Um, this is her room. I still need to decorate it. I kind of gave up. Um, if you have any theme suggestions for Clementine, let me know what you think she'd be into. But this is her room. She is the only child downstairs because she is the youngest. Um, so yeah, give me some ideas for her room if you so much want to. Um, and then we're going to go upstairs. This is very not done. <laughs> this is not done. Um, I just have like all the kids stuff. Uh, just scattered around here um, and then just the cat stuff oh my god do I know the controls just the cat stuff and we will we'll go in here first because this room is plain this is um what uh, Landon's room right don't know his name this is Landon's room uh, you can tell I gave up I don't know what to do with his room I really don't right now he just has a bed and I feel like he's just gonna, I don't know what he's into. I really don't, but give me help. Give me, I need help on his room. You can um, just throw some suggestions my way. I don't know. Um, this is Oliver's room. Um, it's kind of boring. He just has like a little couch and a TV for gaming. Um, it was really cute, but for some reason he couldn't get into his bed. So I had to like move it. Um, I need to throw some pictures in here. It's just, it's very plain. I gave up. <laughs> Very much so. Um, we'll go into the bathroom since we got a, a glimpse. Um, just a plain bathroom, nothing special. Um, just, you know, for them to do their things. Um, and then we're going to go into Aiden's room. One of my favorite rooms of the house is Aiden's room. I love this room. He just has like a little bookshelf and, you know, just his like, just his little area. It's very small and I really like it. This room reminds me of like The Sims too. And I just kind of like it. Anyway. And then we're going to go into Alea's room. It's very purple. She does have a TV because, you know, she's special. She wants to watch TV in bed. Um, yeah, it's really cute and girly. And I just, I really, really like it. And I think it's really, really cute. Um, it's very grown up from the old room she used to have. But I like it. But this house really needs an upgrade. It just needs to be upgraded and stuff. But... I bet you guys are asking where the hell is Parker sleeping. Um, Parker got an upgrade. Anyway, we're going to go into the backyard. And we're going to have a little other house. There's there's a whole other house. <laughs> so we just have like a little yard area for the kids to play. I need to put some stuff down. As you can see, there's a little sneak peek over there that I have to tell you guys about. We have um, Nicole's garden that she's starting. Um, a pool. Haven't put anything around the pool because it's still springtime. Um... But, as I like to call this, this is our pool house. 
but technically it is Parker's house. He still lives with us, but he just has his own little place and it's really cute. Um, so yeah, he just has like a little seating area with a little kitchen. And then if we go over here, um, it's his little bedroom, little nerd dungeon. And then he just has a plain little bathroom. Oh, I forgot a mirror. Damn it. Anyway. That's uh that's the house you guys. It's um it's really cute. I really really enjoy it. Um Hold on. I'm like real confused. Okay, there we go. So yeah, Parker just has like the little pool house. I guess uh what my idea was for that was there I, I didn't want to build a basement cuz I really wanted the garage for stuff. Um, so I was like, you know, we have a pool, so why don't I just make like a pool house and say he renovated it to have his own little apartment, which I thought was a cool idea because he is the only young adult in the family so far. Um, and he's going to want his own little space and just to kind of do like his own thing. Um, so, you know, and eventually he's going to want to get married and have a baby and they'll have enough room to at least, you know give birth to the child and then move out because I, I kind of want to in this LP I want it to be really long and I want to start their life off and then have them move out I don't want to like just move them out and see what they do <sighs> yeah like I want to be in control but yeah and I also want to get um did Landon's ever yeah his toys I was really concerned that his toy wasn't going to come out again but I need to make his toy come to life and I want to wait until he's a young adult, but I do want to make it real. But yeah, I love this house so far. This side of the house looks so cute, and then the, like this side, it's like, uh, what happened? <laughs> um, but by the way, Libby, our sweet old puppy, did pass away sadly while making this beautiful house. Well, I didn't make the house; well, I decorated it. While decorating, Libby passed away sadly. Um, I don't know. I don't know if there was like a part where my game crashed and she did pass away in that part. And I don't know if it was in a part that I posted or in a part that I deleted. I'm going to have to go back and check that because I don't know if she's died twice in this LP or just once. I don't know. In my actual gameplay, she's technically died twice. But that's a little, it's a little morbid. Anyway, the kids are actually headed off to school. Um... I don't know if we're actually going to be working the daycare today because it was glitchy at the old house. I'm wondering if we're at a new house that it's not going to be so glitchy. But I'm going to have him go ahead and take care of Clementine. Go ahead and feed her on the floor. I don't have a high chair. I need to get one. Anybody going to school? You need to stop eating your spaghetti and go to school. Anybody else? Okay. I think that's it. Oh, I guess he's gonna do it. I guess he's the only one taking care of his sister. Cute. Anyway, he can go take a bath and then have some pancakes this morning. Um, this part might be not so much gameplay and just showing the house, but we'll play a little bit of it today. But I want to get, you know, familiar with the house. I haven't really fully played in the house, so I kind of forget where everything's at. But yeah, we definitely need to do Clementine's room because she is about to, I guess we don't have to because she ages up in two days. Um, so technically, if we don't really need a nursery. And I guess the babysitting career is just not going to be working out for us. I'm going to actually have her... I was going to have her quit. I just don't know. I don't know if I want her to quit and then retry or just retire. What's wrong with you? You have a dirty diaper? Why don't you go ahead and give her a bath? Go ahead and give her a, a bath. I need to start putting out more Supernatural and, um... Uh, single mom, that's what it is. And I'm thinking about bringing the Lepacy back. If you guys are interested in seeing the Lepacy, let me know. Um, but I do also have some other LPs that I want to bring to my channel, like the Not So Berry Challenge. Um, I just haven't decided which Sims I want to play it in. <sighs> okay, so she's fine. Actually, you know what? Let's get some toys for the backyard. Um, 
that's what we can do is some toys, you know, for them to play on. She, I mean, technically it'd just be for her. She's like our only baby left. <laughs> so we'll get her. I want to get her like a little sandbox. I just don't know which one I want. Because I want it to be like kid friendly and cute. That's just like a really big sandbox. I don't even know if she can use a sandbox. Uh, we'll do like the... No, I don't like that one. We'll do the one that came with Generations, I guess. I don't like that one either. Where's the wood one? Let me go in here. I'm real confused. Is it in here? Yeah, it is. Okay, there should be like um. I thought there was a wood one. Was there not? I could do like the beehive one. That's so freaking cute. <laughs> it's just so cute. Is there any other colors? No, they're kind of gross. She can't even play on it, so I don't know why I'm doing this. We'll get her... We'll get her one of these. For now. And we'll get her... I don't like that one. We'll get this one. I like this one. And then eventually, you know, we'll get more stuff for her. But she can't even, like, play with anything right now. Um, I was going to get a trampoline, but that's a little too big. Maybe we'll get her her little playpen for outside for now. We'll do a purple pink one. Just for her to have something to play in while she's outside. Because I don't want her to feel like she's left out, but I want her to be outside. You know what I mean? And then I really... I don't know if I want to expand this or not. Maybe not. We'll get some, like, lawn chairs for now and just have, um... I don't know which ones I want. I'm really picky right now. We'll do these. These are kind of cute. They came with late night. I never use them. I always use like the same one. So we'll do... Oh, wait. I love these so much. I want to do this one. Yeah, we'll just put out... Just some like little lawn chairs. Ooh, you know what we should do is get like a grill. Where do I want my grill? I want it over here. We'll just do this one. That one's cute. Yeah. Okay, that's all we'll do for now. I'll have um Will come over here. He's a little hungry. Um what time is it? It's like 9 a.m. Let's go ahead and put, we'll play with Clementine on the ride, and then we'll put her in the pen, and then we need to tend to our garden, and then Will's making his way to the kitchen, slowly but surely. Um, you can serve hot dogs for breakfast, that's sad. We'll have him a uh, nap by the pool, why not? I really wish your sims could like mow the yard, that'd be so cute. Anyway, look at it! It's so stinking cute. I miss this kind of stuff. Why is that so freaking cute? It's just so stinking cute. I love it. I wish the daycare would work for, <laughs> for this town. But for some reason it just doesn't. And it's sad. Well, eventually I need you to, like, get the mail. What? What's Parker doing? He's taking a shower. He's not doing anything. What's wrong with our cat? Oh, she's fine. I don't even know her name. Lucy. Right, got it. Okay. Alright, he's gonna go take his little nappy poo by the pool. Poor baby. Where's Clementine? You didn't even... Okay, you had to go pee, my bad. Oh, oh, what a life. What a life. Can you imagine? 
Can you imagine? Just yeah, this this is it. This is it. I really hate how that tree intersects the house like that, but this is the life. Oh, I wish I had this life. Oh, clicking all kinds of buttons. Okay, um, I probably need to go ahead and end this part right here. That way it's not too long. Um, not really sure what we're going to do in the next part, but I am excited that we're in a new house. Uh, you guys let me know if you want the leprosy to come back or, well, and if you, uh, what, how we should decorate the bedrooms, um, in some parts of the house because I'm running out of ideas and I keep doing the same themes over and over and over and I need to stop doing that. So just give me some ideas and let me know what you want. Um, I love you guys. I'm hopefully I'm going to get a lot of videos out this week. I'm going to try my best. But I love you guys, and make sure you hit that like button, and subscribe, <laughs> turn on the bell notifications, so you know when I post, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Bye.